was able to meet the man who received a life-saving lung transplant at St. Joseph's Hospital in Medical Center in Phoenix, thanks to her husband's condition. For more on the story, you can watch a video of the touching moment at the KPAR.com. Time for an update on traffic. We go live to the Valley Chevy Dealers Traffic Center. Here's John Roller. All right, Jeff, still seeing a little bit of slowing coming into town from the West Valley on the eastbound I-10. We had that earlier stalled vehicle right near 43rd Avenue. That's cleared away, but we got another stalled vehicle eastbound I-10 right at uh, the 19th yes, five, four, Avenue off-ramp there. It is yes, in the four, point, so causing a little bit of a curiosity yes, factor yes, from the eastbound I-10 yes, to the northbound I-17. Other than that, we got a new crash yes, coming yes, in off yes, north yes, on the 135th yes, Avenue, and a police investigation has shut down Broadway road between 7th and 2nd Avenue coming into downtown. John Roller, KTAR News. Sunny today with a high of 103. Tonight clear, the low 75. Right now in Phoenix, sunny skies, 90 degrees. Weather's brought to you by Howard